नमस्कार इंडिया मेट्रोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट वेलकम टू इन इट्स डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग इन दिस ब्रीफिंग वी विल सी हाउ द साउथ वेस्ट मानसून हैज प्रोग्रेस्ड ओवर द पार्ट्स ऑफ सेंट्रल इंडिया पार्ट्स ऑफ द ईस्ट इंडिया हाउ एंड हाउ द साउथ वेस्ट मानसून इज गोइंग टू फर्दर एडवांस इन टू पार्ट्स ऑफ नॉर्थ वेस्ट इंडिया एंड वी विल ऑल्सो सी इन विच स्टेट्स आर गोइंग टू एक्सपीरियंस हैवी और वेरी हैवी रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी इन द अपकमिंग फोर टू फाइव डेज एंड स्टर्डे द वेरी हैवी रेनफॉल वॉज रिपोर्टेड ओवर द Telangana and Ghat areas of the Madhya Maharashtra. However, heavy rainfall was also reported over the Gujarat region, Chhattisgarh, North Interior Karnataka, and Kerala and Tamil Nadu. Over the North East India, mainly Assam, Meghalaya, Tripura, and Sikkim also reported the heavy rainfall activity. And if you look for the progress of the southwest monsoon, then in this map we can see uh, through this blue color line. This line basically represents up to means up to which area the southwest monsoon has been advanced, and this entire white color area represents the area where the monsoon at to, ad to be advanced so the today southwest monsoon has been advanced into some more parts of the gujarat state remaining parts of the maharashtra some more parts of the madhya pradesh and uh, uh, remaining parts of the chatisgarh remaining parts of the odisha and even the today southwest monsoon has been uh, advanced into the some parts of the south jharkhand which can be seen uh, in this map and even the red color line represents the how the southwest monsoon usually progress towards the northwest india and in the upcoming 3 to 4 days southwest monsoon is very likely to advance into the some more parts of the gujarat uh, state some more parts of the madhya pradesh and the remaining parts of the west bengal remaining parts of the bihar jharkhand and uh, even the some parts of the east of the some parts of the uttar pradesh and uttarakhand also the southwest monsoon is very likely to be advanced in during next 3 to 4 days if you look for the today's main chief synoptic features in today's circulation can be seen over the northern parts of the haryana in the lower tropospheric layers and the western disturbances still lie over the pakistan area over the central rajasthan a cyclonic circulation can be seen and a trough runs from the central rajasthan up to the south chhattisgarh another cyclonic circulation mainly in the lower and middle tropospheric levels lies over the south chhattisgarh a trough another trough basically runs from the south chhattisgarh up to the south maharashtra coast in the lower tropospheric levels and along the west coast mainly the uh, uh, an entrough at the mean sea level can be seen uh, of the maharashtra coast of the goa karnataka and of the kerala coast because of these synoptic features if you look for the heavy rainfall warning then mainly the entire the western coast uh, many parts of the western coast very likely to experience heavy to very heavy rainfall activity during all the five days and however the gujarat state likely to receive the heavy to very heavy rainfall activity only during next 2 to 3 days but the very heavy rainfall activity will continue mainly over the konkan region goa region ghat areas of the madhya maharashtra coastal karnataka south interior karnataka and kerala during next 5 days and even on today isolated extremely heavy rainfall where the rainfall can reach uh, 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 more than 20 cm at one or two places over the coastal karnataka south interior karnataka and the north kerala region so we have issued the red alert particularly for for the coast of karnataka south indire karnataka and the northern parts of the kerala for today and over the uh, over the mainly the uh, central india today the madhya pradesh vidarbha and chatisgarh also likely to get heavy rainfall activity along with the thunderstorm and the very strong wind in the gustiness where the wind speed can reach up to the uh, 42 to uh, 60 km ph or mainly over the madhya pradesh and adjoining parts of the vidarbha region and over the uh, uh, on the 25th june onwards as we have seen that the southwest monsoon very likely to advance over the uh, uh, over the remaining parts of the jharkhand west bengal bihar and some parts of the uttar pradesh and uttarakhand so mainly from the uh, 25th june on uh, june onwards the heavy to very heavy rainfall activity will be seen mainly over the bihar bihar jharkhand eastern parts of the uttar pradesh and some parts of the uh, uttarakhand from 25th of june this heavy to, to very heavy rainfall activity will continue on 26th of june and 27th of june as well and from the uh, 26th of june uh, sub zone the rainfall activity will will increase mainly over the eastern parts of the uh, country so heavy rainfall will also be seen over the odisha chatisgarh and east madhya pradesh and subsequently this rainfall belt will shift to, uh, towards the northwestward so subsequently on 27th of june the heavy rainfall will also be experienced over the west madhya pradesh and uh, 
ईस्ट राजस्थान वेस्ट मध्य वेस्ट उत्तर प्रदेश आल्सो लाइकली टू गेट हैवी रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी मेनली ऑन ट्वेंटी सिक्स एंड ट्वेंटी सेवन ऑफ जून एंड सिमिलरली अंडमान निकोबार आईलैंड वेरी लाइकली टू रिसीव द हैवी रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी ड्यूरिंग ऑल द फाइव डेज एंड सिमिलरली द लक्षद्वीप एरिया लाइकली टू गेट हैवी रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी ऑन टूडे एंड टूमारो Uh, if you look for the heat wave condition, so uh, over the uh, most parts of the country there is uh, there is uh, 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 no heat wave conditions is likely over the any parts of the country during all uh, during next five days mainly except parts of the Haryana, parts of Punjab and some parts of the adjoining West Uttar Pradesh where the heat wave conditions are likely at one or two places on 24th of June and 25th of June and from 26th of June again the rainfall activity will be will start mainly over the punjab haryana west uttar pradesh rajasthan etc and adjoining areas so the uh, again the heat wave conditions over the punjab haryana and uttar pradesh will await from the 26th of june onwards for more detailed uh, weather information you can visit the md website you can follow us on our facebook page our youtube channel and our twitter page thank you